Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Dave the Diver. And today is a big day. It's VIP day. D-Day. And I did a little research also into the tool now because I was very confused. And apparently, so you remember, we learned how to use that new trap and that's how we hunted down the tool now. And uh, yeah, so this is it right here. You can see a bigger and stronger net trap to catch large fish. Net is automatically released when the sensor detects any movement. So the way you catch tuna <laughs> is you find these steel net sensor traps either in the shop or indeed in the boxes around the world. So we can't like always guarantee we can go in and catch tuna. <laughs> I'm very thinking, thinking very hard about saying the words tuna, <laughs> but um, it is something we can kind of accommodate for. Now, we are going on a fairly chill initial dive here. Um, I've got my Marinka page up on my phone. And what I'd like to do is catch some fish that we don't have in three stars and get them three stars. So funnily enough, the blue tang, even though I've caught a gajillion of them, we actually didn't have in three stars. Uh, these little red dudes, I think we also don't have in three stars. Well, it's not always easy to tell, especially when you miss. Thank you. Cardinal Fisher. Yep, yeah, that was new as well. We need a clown fish if we can see it. So we're just, we're just going to get some new free star fish. Maybe go catch that little seahorse over there if we can get down there. Hwa, hwa. Now the question is, do I want to... I've only got... Oh, I've got two nets. Uh, do I want to catch tuna is the question. Also, do I need these little... I do need these little dudes as well. But, really? God damn. <laughs> I'm going to need more ammo. But that should be three more three-star critters we never had. We didn't really have, like, anything to focus on in this dive, so... For the first time in ages, it's a chill little dive. Do I want to catch a tuna? Oh, uh, yeah, we probably do, because we've got that mission coming up, right? So, they go to the right. We need to make sure we're placing it in a clever place. And they go to the left. Actually, if I put it here, I think it should be fine. <laughs> okay, two more for the list. Uh, we're not going to catch you with one. The other one, I'm hopeful maybe we can catch a shark or something instead. There are a myriad of uh, large critters that we can... Um... Do I need freestyle you? I do need freestyle you, the batfish. But I've got no ammo left. So, ah, there we go. And you as well. Yeah, and you as well. <laughs> Where's that little batty fish gone? I don't know what batty means, <laughs> um, but it's a term. Oh, I need you as well. I think it means crazy, if I remember correctly. People, it's it's, it's a term. It's I, I'm pretty sure it's a British thing. People would call people batty. A bit batty, mate. Hey, batty boy, that kind of thing. I don't know. Feels slurry. This this little dude here. This little dude here is who we're after. We need a puffer fish. It's not on my list. Where's the puffer fish gone? Okay, I didn't take a photo of the puffer fish, so I've got no idea. I feel like I feel like we had a freestyle puffer fish, right? I, I actually was trying to hit the puffer fish there. <laughs> just just in case I'm gonna grab one. And then we're gonna go grab hopefully a, a shark. I don't know if that's how this works. This, this sensor trap thing, but you know, we've got to experiment, right? Try some things out. Um, there's a few others, like the parrot fish and the the black and white one that we could do with. Are you coming with me? Titan trigger fish. Do I need you? I'm not sure. I don't think so. This guy, I do need. This this big boy over here. But I'm assuming the net is not going to work on him because he's a large, a large lad. There's a seaweed we need. We also need these guys as well, so I really need to find more ammo, basically, is what's going on here. But it'd be good to get that. I don't, like I said, I don't think there's any real benefit to it, but it makes me happy. Is that not a real benefit? That sounds like a real benefit. I need some ammunition, though. And I'm gonna need some bloody oxygen at some point. Jeez, Louise. There's my ammunition, though. What about these white ones? Maybe. Alright, let's go grab 
Uh, these parrot ones over here. You're a parrot, right? I mean, you're a parrot. Yep, Mediterranean parrot face. Now, I'm pretty sure. Where's my big, where's my big bulky boy gone? Right, I need to stop sprinting because I'm actually going to die. I haven't found any oxygen anywhere so far. This is at least five or six new freestyle species, though, so that's really good, and I can take another photo after this and we can work on that. Like I said, I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of creatures in the shallows we just don't have access to. But who knows? What about these little blue boys? Yeah, didn't I already get the blue boy, though? Got another one. Right, the shark is what I want. Um, I don't know if this works. Let's find out. Okay. Oh, of course, I've only got one. Oh, I'm an idiot. I thought I had two because they... Ah. Oh. I've got... Oh, man. Because the, the, the tool... That's for um for two shots. Oh, oh, man! I, where's the bloody oxygen at? <laughs> Why is there no oxygen anywhere? What is going on? I have to. I'm gonna have to leave. Oh, I need to. I need these, right? Yeah, that was one hit kill. Try this out on this guy, just in case. I don't think it'll work, but you never know. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Right, I'm just going to leave. It feels a bit strange leaving. Oh, there's O2 there. Oh, and there. <laughs> um, I guess we can stay. What is this? Wait, wait, wait. Hello? Oh, hello? Ah! Okay, I've never seen that before. Um, I feel like I probably... Oh, is that a different tuna as well? I think it might be. Ah! You're proper out to get me, aren't you? <laughs> Are you? Were you always there? Did I just never see you before somehow? Oh, you're a toughie! Another one I could send up. Interesting. Stingray, yeah. Okay, that's interesting. I wonder if new species have been added to the list. Man, now I want to upgrade the, um... The, uh... The thing. The drone. It costs so much, though. But the fact that you get two... It kind of makes it perfect, right? You know, you get the, the, the net capture thing, and it gives you two things, so you want to be able to send up two drones. These tuna... They do look different to me. Um, let me have a look at my list. How did I get the sea urchins? It's the yellow striping. I don't think the ones I caught had the yellow striping. Bloody hell. I really should have just clicked up instead of down. <laughs> Wait, this is by weight. They're at the top, surely. It's my tuna. Oh, it got sent away. I don't have it with me. Of course. Uh, right, I just want to go... Oh, hello. I don't need you for anything. I'm just going to stock up with some random fish, really. Because why not, basically. Neither, so we're just going to stock up with shallows fish. Nothing special today. Hmm. It's just, it's so expensive at 6k. It really is. But I think maybe getting the, like, maybe I wouldn't want two upgrades, because then I'd have to get two. You know, if I, if I can take three drones, then that means I need to take, I'd need to find two of the net traps, and that's obviously not going to reliably happen. But I, th I think upgrading the first one is probably worth it, yeah. I think I probably will do that. Give me fish in the morning, I pray. Do, 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 do. Give me fish until the break of the day. It's good to have, like, backup fish, you know. And I am missing something. 
I've got like a blank slate in my Marinka book. I'm missing a fish in this area. I don't know what it is. Like, like, like what I feel is like quite a basic. I'm sorry, buddy. I mean, I need to, I need to put it out of his misery. Surely that's better than having it starved to death in the net. I feel bad, honestly. The problem is I've got too much weight. <laughs> like I've got too. Oh, oh, I got the. Thought that was new for a second. Then no, I got the the, the tooth for the first time. I can't bother. One more. One more for good luck. Let's get out of here. Update my Marinka. Dum, 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 dum. Use as ingredient. Okay. Keep in inventory. Oh, right. Oh. Well, we want to keep it, right? Bluefin tuna. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is a different tuna. We get so much of it, though. I think what we want to do... Surely... Tuna... <laughs> oh, hello. Well, what's going on? These earthquakes are getting wild. There's Dr. Bacon over there. Whoa, a strong earthquake all of a sudden. Earthquakes are becoming more frequent and intense. Should go check if Banjo Sushi is all right. We're going to head down in a second anyway. Udo. Sir, ready to take pictures of manta rays. Hired some lighting guys and made them set up lighting fixtures at the right places. Oh, he must have spent some money. Eh, one can't pass up an opportunity like this. He told me the lighting fixtures were set at for 20 meters. All right. I mean, yeah, we'll go down. We'll do it now. We don't need a long session of Bancho, we just need enough to go in and uh, do the, the recipe for Michael Bank. Um, I do want to check the... can I go to the fish farm? Tuna! Tuna would seem the logical thing to grow in the fish farm, right? I've got one bluefin tuna. Do I have any... No, wow. I've got so many eggs, though. I've got a shark. I must have had the row. Okay, we'll let those grow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get more tuna. <laughs> uh, what have we got in here? That's crazy. Tons of stuff. Whoa, we've got a tiger shark! Oh, very cool. Okay, we could breed tiger shark if we wanted. That's pretty sweet. That's a 67% and that's a 34%. Okay, we've got plenty of space left, I think. Okay, I like that idea. Um, go check in on the farm. And we'll go diving. Not a big dive, we'll just go in and... Uh, that's rice, that's rice, that's rice, that's rice, okay. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, let's have a little look at this. So, yeah, there you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven new free stars. And the great and the, actually nothing was in the shrimp over there. Yeah, it's this fish that I don't understand. What's this fish here? What are you? <laughs> Zero to fifty meters. You know, it's 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 up there. It's a common fish, I think. Right, let me get a new photo so I know what I'm looking for. Do 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 do. More excuse to spend time listening to this music, and we'll do it for the. Uh, uh, there's less I need here, really. To the boat. Let's go get this manta ray photo. Very exciting. Do, 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 do. It's a little bit of a shame because I'd like to do a full session. I need some I need some cash at the end of the day. So I wouldn't mind doing a full session at Bancho, but that's what it is. It is what it is.
Hello, buddy. You new? Could be new. Yeah, white shrimp. Nice. I still haven't, I feel like, done like a full, proper nocturnal exploration, you know? I've got to imagine we don't have most things. Earth three star rating in nocturnal. How did that miss? God damn it. God damn! Ah! Just gonna grab a few. And then we're going for 20 meters of depth. She's just so they leave you alone or anything else. The swarm! The swarm! There's nothing. Oh, wait. I figured out how to take on the swarm. Feels like I'm in an episode of Piranha. Not an episode of Piranha, it's not an episode. What's that? Caught 20 fish with melee weapons. Yeah, that'll do it. Leave me alone, man. I can't see because of the wood. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Ah! <laughs> Well, I've never seen that before. <laughs> I need to bait him out of the way and then try to get the O2. Oh my god, there's a little fish. There's a little fish! Oh no, <laughs> a little fish! Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> that little dude started nibbling on me and so nearly got me killed. My god. Genuinely right on the cusp of death because of that little fish nibbling on me. <coughs> it's not worth sending it up. It's only going to be a two star anyway. <laughs> I can't believe that fish nearly got me killed. Oh my god. Alright. But I, I'm going to imagine it's up here to the right. The lighting setup we're looking for. That bloody music in my head now. Do, 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 do. That's a different song entirely. We're about 20 meters, so let's just go to the right. It's gonna be over here. Oh, there it is. Those look like lighting fixtures. The sharks must have knocked them down. We need to pop them up and connect them again before taking pictures. Illuminated to lure plankton by dropping the lure capsule in the middle. Nice. I'd love to go night diving. I see glowing worms, they make the scene surreal. Ah, manta rays won't come if I'm here. I should hide behind the pile of rocks. Like I said, I've been scuba diving a few times. I love scuba diving, but I've never been scuba diving at night. How cool would it be to go scuba diving with bioluminescent plankton and stuff swimming around? That'd be amazing. Oh, what a beaut. Really is a manta ray. I must keep my distance and I'll scare it off. So cool. I 
I got too close to go worms this bit. But what? Well, that's where the photo opportunity is. What? <laughs> How do I take a photo of the manta ray? Alright, I'm just gonna sit. But the photo button is over there. When do I go? <laughs> I'm really confused. I'm a little, I'm a little, right, I'm a little confused right now. Um, how do you expect me to take this photo? Is there a time I'm missing that I'm meant to be going closer? Because I thought I'll go when there's no worms, when the plankton have been um, eaten. I've got text, whatever text. I'm going to let it sit for a minute. Well, I check my things. <laughs> my Capital One card's like... Rah, 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 rah. What you been saying? <sighs> I'll see that later. Um, I might have to Google this. Dave... The Diver Manta Ray pick. Sneaking between the lighting fish. No, that doesn't make sense to me. Bear with me, folks. Oh. Apparently I can just... Okay. Ah, okay. The target's illuminated. Okay, let's wait for it to come back in. Wasn't great, was it? <laughs> that was so beautiful. See you later, buddy. Uh, let's have a little poke around whilst we're here. So we haven't really explored that much at Nocturnal, especially not in the deeper depths, so I wouldn't mind having a little poke. Seeing if we can find anything cool. There's not that many species in the Nocturnal set. And we did get an orange starfish though, so it's all coming up Millhouse. These are the these are the worst things down here. <laughs> More than any of the sharks. These are bloody swarms. I know it's a shoal, but it's a swarm, really. That's a more. It's three hits, isn't it? Oh, bloody hell! That not all of those are built equally. Just so you know, <laughs> some of them are a lot harder than the others. Oh, I like that one. More bloody pink seashells, of course. Let's go down. See what we can find. We've got some shrimpies. Are you shrimp? You don't look like... Yeah, it is. Look very strange. They look like little dudes. Little dude arms. And little dude things. These dudes I want to do. I'm not sure if I've got you in the three stars. That's Oh, never mind then. 
You're a monster like everything else, apparently. Ooh, pink, pink, pink. So got a way out. Flask. About two. Lovely. Don't mind if I do. The sea definitely feels less alive at night. There's a lot less going on. Not finding much. Must be sad. I'm not even allowed in the depths. Um, I think we should probably just leave there. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. Nocturnal, just come in, get everything once, and then, yeah. There's not, there's not much to the nocturnal swimming so far. Maybe it'll get better, don't get me wrong. I mean, there's a tiger shark still. These evil squid. Why are you pink? Oh, hello, you're new. You're going to try to murder me as well? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, you are. Ow. Ow. Right, can you leave me alone? Goddamn squid. I want this. Uh-oh. That doesn't even work on those. What the hell are you? Ah! Okay, that's new. This is a sneaky fish. The devil scorpion fish. The nights are dark and full of terrors, ladies and gentlemen. The nights are dark and full of terrors. Jeez Louise. I need to get some O2. Sure. Small upgrade. I wanna I wanna go get that that squid. Ignore the fact that there's a tiger shark right next to it. That's minor details. Minor details. Let's go get it. It's new. New is exciting. Oh, I hit the tag shark, yeah. I think that's the first time I've seen the AoE effects do anything. Okay. I've never used... Thinking about taking on the shark, aren't I? I've never seen that effect before. I've never seen the, the lightning effect like that. I'm surprised they haven't managed to get like a, a longer harpoon yet. That that hasn't. Better upgrade! Okay, that was weird. Oh, wow! Whoa! <laughs> okay! <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing! <laughs> That's really lank. Oh, it gave me a restart because of the... Oh, no. <laughs> I've already done the map. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. But the manta ray wasn't here. And it says I've already taken a photo of the manta ray. I worry that the game is now broken. What? There's no photo icon. Because I've already done it. I'm going to see if I can just leave. It's a little bit of a shame that I've lost out all the work I just did, but it is what it is. Oh, man. 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 We'll have to go diving again at night time. And get those st things we noticed at the bottom. Oh, bah, 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 bah. God damn tech shock. It's a manta ray. Look how majestic it is. My eyes are teary, you see? I'm just kidding. Editors will love this picture for sure. You're my hero. I'll see you again.
Oh, a thousand quid, not bad. Thanks, kid. From now on, photo spots appear at night as well. Take nice evening pictures. Man. That's the first real disastrous event I feel like I've had. I still got the... The photos, though. Like the devil scorpion fish. Because we didn't get... We got that after the manor raid. So everything we got pre... Yeah, okay. I guess it's not as bad then. Alright. I just missed the chance to get that little squid thing that I wanted. I've got three of these done. Four of these done. Jeez Louise. Alright, we're getting there. We're getting there. 150 to go. Four more pink shells, tons of fossils, one more fine tooth, some white spot jellyfish, and a few more starfish. Finally, we'll get there. Right, let's go open this blim blamming restaurant. We need some money. We're not going to make that much, but we do have a VIP. So that's something. Something's happening. Banjo, I felt a big earthquake. Is your place okay? Took some measures against earthquakes after it crumbled last time. I'm not sure for how long it will withstand a series of strong earthquakes. Hey, back on. Everyone okay? Dr. Back on. I was passing by. I wanted to make sure you were all right. Looks like everyone's okay. Dave, what about sea people business? Any problem? Uh, the heat from the ground is slowly melting the ice of the sea people village. Many sea people got sick because of that. To identify the cause, I need to go down to the glacial area that blocks the heat and investigate, but there seem to be eerie monsters down there. I don't feel safe. That sounds like trouble, Dave. According to ancient records, sea people are very susceptible to temperature change. You should go down to the glacial area ASAP and find out what's happening there. It would be honourable to sacrifice yourself for the sea people, even if it means getting frozen. Excuse me? Never mind, we can worry about that tomorrow. Today we feast and have a fun, lucky time. We still haven't done anything with the upgraded dive suit that we got. Hey, phew, this place is rather hot. Is the food ready yet? Be honest now, I won't chide you for it if it isn't. Here you are, the food that will make your inspiration skyrocket. Looks like an explosive dish, all right? It looks nice, but will the taste justify its fanciness? Let's try it. Here we go. Banjo's just going Super Saiyan. Super Sushi Chef. I got you. It's coming to me, yes. Such powerful inspiration filling my soul. I haven't felt this way in a while. This rice, not easy to find such rice in these parts. How did you... I had some help from a friend. I'm glad to see you like it. If you continue making your masterful movies that pluck at the heartstrings, you're welcome to eat here whenever you like. You're quite the man. I like your style. Perhaps my next movie should be about sushi bar. It should feature a man with a missile launcher in one hand. What kind of story is that? Haha, <laughs> in any case, I think I'm all set, thanks to you. This is a robot samurai poster with my autograph. You can have it as a gift. My gosh, Robot Samurai. Look forward to the next movie. Sure to be an exhilarating one. 1,000 quid. 50 likes. That was the big deal there, actually. It's a huge move towards um, the number we were working on. Let's keep picking up these tuna recipes when we can. Ready for a couple days' time. Uh, new interior deco one. Oh, of course. No, it can't be this. It's got to be the portrait of Sergio. Adorable. Right. Right, 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 right. What are we doing today? We are... Okay, whoa. Tropical fish sushi set. That's got to be good. Maybe those are the fish we want to do. That's, that's really high money. And they're pretty easy fish to get. Maybe those are the ones. I'm just going to take a little pick of that. Maybe that's maybe that's our money maker right there. It just utilizes the things we've already got set up quite nicely. It's, more, it's worth more than the tuna. That's why I'm thinking about it. Also, it uses more, but they're all easy to catch. So. I can't even find the tuna. 
Yeah, so the tuner's okay. It's not, it's not great. I'm gonna upgrade this, aren't I? Yeah. Just a couple times. We need to make sure we've got plenty of it going, but we've already got 27, so. You okay, Banjo? And same with this one. Oh wait, so that's bluefin. Now I'm now confused. How do I have 27 there and 14 there? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, true toro, do toro. Right, that'll do. Uh, right, what we're gonna sell today. Um, I don't wanna use my rice. I think I am gonna keep it. I'm gonna sell this, obviously. As we do, the Goblin Shark. Now, I really want to sell all 10 of those, so I don't want to sell more than... I just want to make sure the other thing we sell is like a limited amount. I got my tuna up to very high value. We're going to make a lot of money in a couple days. Mega Mouth, Mega Mouth. Let's say, oh, we can upgrade it as well. Let's sell... I'm going to sell six Mega Mouth. Eight Mega Mouth, apparently. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I clicked it. Right, that's all I'm going to sell. I'm not doing anything else. Because I want to make sure we get as much of these sold as we can. Let's see how much we have left with 18 things for sale. Bear in mind it's a two-thirds night as well. Which means I probably shouldn't have done it tonight, actually. <laughs> now that I think about it. It is what it is. I once again did not understand how you poor beer in this game. Not a clue. Sometimes it works perfectly and sometimes it doesn't. I don't... There must be something I can do, but I don't know what it is. I really don't have a... I, I just don't know. This is one I want to sell, right? Yep, that was nearly sold out already, which is good. Just 600 quid a pop. Okay. I'm going to sell out, which is not cool. Does mean yeah, that's the last one there. It does mean you can't have any. <laughs> I'm not pouring the beer. I'm not pouring the beer. I got four left, so we sold fourteen on a two thirds. We we lost some Mega Mouth, but that's not a big deal. I sold six thousand of the other one though, so that's that's great. Yeah, best day. Of course it was. That's how you have to do that. That goddamn beer. I can't, I'm not pouring beer anymore. I'm just not. I can pour the tea. I'm not. Oh, drop the back on. Oh. Right. Oh. Haha, the wind is always cool and nice at night. I'm sobering up now. Beep, beep, beep. The radar of the sea people detected oh, something. Yeah, yeah. Not from the water, just how. One of the Gadons managed to get its way to the surface. Oh no, but I can't be careful. Receiving signals from this cave. Maybe you should have a light. Or someone with you. Or a weapon. <laughs> this cave doesn't look like it's naturally formed. Worth an investigation. Oh. I get to play this. God, this game is wild. <laughs> it just keeps doing new shit. I love it. Yeah, okay. This is cool. Less ominous than I thought it was going to be. What a surprise, a mural in a place like this? Quite different from the murals of the people I saw in the sea. Let me examine it closely. Picture of sea people and humans. Is this something that actually happened? The children of both humans and sea people. Are they hanging out together? See, people are giving some shiny fruit to humans, perhaps. Maybe that's why humans developed eventually, because they, like... Device of some sort here. I think I've seen some of these letters on the murals. Oh. Oh. A 
Uh, squiggly worm. Pyramid. Blow Witch logo. Quickly worm. Pyramid. Blair Witch logo. <laughs> oh, this, no, that's right. Oh, is it actually in the order? Okay. I, I was kind of, because the red is in different places. So I was kind of adjusting for that, but I think I maybe don't do that. So I need to mo swap these two around, I think. Pyramid. Squiggly worm. Yep. Bravo, the door is open. Looks dark and creepy, but a true archaeologist never misses this kind of opportunity. Let's see what's inside. True archaeologist would have been prepared. Whoa. Oh no. This place, look at all these bones and torture devices. I must examine the mural in the back to find clues. Looks like the humans collapsed after eating the fruit. I don't think the fruit was edible. Humans hunted the sea people. Looks like a lot of them were killed. That's what happened to her. Humans could live in harmony with the sea people were it not for small misunderstandings. Let's bring this artifact for future research. Oh. Sea people rebreather. It seems sea people made it for humans. Oh, rebreather. That's an exciting idea. Wow, this looks like a breathing apparatus. Sea people device made for humans. Dr. Pokemon, you gotta get out of there, buddy. What's that noise outside? Pirates. What? Who is that? Why is he here? Ah, pirates, what are you doing here? Raiding? Back to the boat. Not very good pirates, are they? If they manage to let him get away there. <laughs> this is our turf. Give us whatever you have right now. They won't let us go easily if we stop now. Let's get as far away as we can. Why is he saying we? Does he know I'm controlling him? Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I got a game. Get jukes, pirate scum. Bit harsh. Bit harsh. <laughs> I want to sit in the middle. Oh, come on. You can't, like, if you're at the top and there's one at the top, you can't move out of the way in time to get out of the way. You just can't move out. You don't have time to get out of the way. There's a lot of little games in this game that feel just a teeny bit imbalanced, like they needed tweaking the numbers 5% in one direction. Con, you're basically Indiana Jones. Whew, almost fainted. Let's take the sea people breathing apparatus for further study. I, I, I'm very curious what that's going to mean for me, a breathing apparatus. Because obviously, they, they can't make us have infinite breath, right? Maybe? No. So, what does that mean? <laughs> Tenzin told me to talk to Suwam at the village. I should check if there are tasks for me, then head to the Sea People Village. Frozen Passage, Chapter 5, baby! Very nice. I was going to say we should check the farming report. Uh, right, so Cookstar. You can see plastics floating in the water sometimes. Bad for marine life, be careful. How are we doing? We've got to be close, right? Yeah, seven more followers and 68 more uh, thingamajiggies. We are getting there. Slowly but surely. How are we doing farm? Right, there's some weeds at the farm, so we'll have to go, have to go take care of that. 
And, ooh, Glacial Passage Fish, two stars. Okay, very exciting. First things first, to the farm. And then we need to go talk to um, Bancho as well about the seaweed. What I don't understand is how we get the nutrients back up to 100%. What if you sell upgrades now? Um, oh. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, I've got 11k. Wow. <laughs> I've got 12k, basically. I'm rich. Okay, let's get some upgrades. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to upgrade the Savage Drone. Only once, but I am going to upgrade it. No, obviously not twice anyway. Um, I'm going to upgrade the suit. Oh, it's maxed. Nice. Just because I felt like, because we're about to enter a new area, maybe we'll need it, you know? Do you sell... I'm going to buy these every day, basically. Alright, what time are we on? Fox, we've got 50 minutes. We can actually, let's go talk to Pancho first. Uh, we've got... Tomorrow is Tuna Day. We saw in front of... Uh, open the door. I don't want to do the Glacial Passage now. We'll do that in the next video. Because we've done a lot of this video already. I don't want to do it when we've only got 15 minutes left. You know? Cuisine made with seaweed. A simple dish using seaweed will not leave a strong impression. They probably have that. The Sea People Village. Bring me seaweed, white rice, and sea urchin. Give them a harmonious blend of ingredients from the land and sea. Let's try gathering them. Do I not already have those? I feel like I do. I brought the ingredients. I'll start preparing sea urchin seaweed rice. Here's your goopy bag. People should be satisfied with this. Thank you, Bancho. Let's bring it to the farmer. Okay. All right. Yeah, we're just going to go catch some fish. Oh, I've got to feed the cat. And high quality feeding. Here you go, buddy. Who's the happy kitty? Who's the happy kitty? Yeah. There will be a reason to do that. Like, something will happen if I feed the cat enough times. I'm not sure what it'll be, but something will happen. All right, let's just go diving. General, try to catch some tuna. Catch some general fish. Just spend 50 minutes diving around. Dumbo octopus. Oh, very cool. That's going to be in the glacial passage. Oh, I should check my... Um, tell what, we'll work on our, uh, our thing as well. Thing of a jiggy. So we need clownfish, for example. Do we need, oh, I might need those little, no, no, I don't. There's a few fish we still need. I swear, you cheeky little blighters, I'm nowhere to be seen when I needed you, and now you're everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Plus four damage really isn't worth it. I don't need you anymore, right? I'm just gonna double check that. Little pink dudes? No, don't need little pink dudes. I'm really curious what this one I'm missing is. I feel like I need to like catch everything again to find out. I just don't know. It's small, it's got like a chubby belly. I don't really have anything else on it. Don't need you. Why am I here again? What am I doing? I don't remember. Get some tuna. It doesn't catch this, the, the small fish, does it? Okay. Okay, so that's we've caught that one a few times now, so we're gonna head. I wonder if it works on this guy. I don't want to test it out, but I do need to catch one of these. I think we probably need a um a, uh, I'll need more trigger fish for that thing. We probably need a hush dart, don't we? Realistically. Maybe I'll just come in with a hush dart specifically to catch it, you know? 
I need you. No, I need to... Where are these clownfish? They're usually higher up, right? What about you guys? No. Looks like there isn't any other tuna. It feels like it's um, a very different shape today. I don't know if I'm going crazy. Yeah, I, sh I should have brought the hush start thinking about it. Maybe we'll find one. Look, we found one. <laughs> now, I don't know if this works, but if I shoot the shark like three times... Actually, if I, maybe I can lure the shark to... There's an ammo box over there, so I can shoot it more than that. I'm just going to try this out. I don't know. If, I don't know. Do I want to wait between each shot? So that hasn't done anything, <laughs> um, to say the least. Well, I can do this, right? And yeah, well, the, the, why, why didn't I think of that in the first point? I have no idea. Right, can I, I want my thing back. I want my, my neck gun back. Mm, little blue dudes, no. That's just, that's just how I'm gonna do it going forward. We'll just use those sensors. Especially when we don't need to catch tuna anymore. Tuna. <laughs> We'll, we'll use the sensor traps and we'll, that's how we'll catch the big fish. Even this this green guy over here. I'll be more used to hush start for that, to be fair. What about you? Maybe for you. Maybe for you. I can't see these ones on the page because they're below where I've taken the photo. So we'll grab them anyway, just in case. I think I remember getting you, but I'm going to grab another one just in case as well. Can I have some O2, please? <laughs> We've established how I have caught, I've caught some fish. That's fantastic. And now I'd like some O2. Mm, that's a porky, isn't it? There's no O2 anywhere. It's right there. <laughs> it always happens. I'm going to keep complaining about it because every time I do, I pretty much immediately get the O2. Let's have a chill eight minutes here, exploring around. Trying to catch as many free fish as we can, just in case. Try to find that one that I'm missing. I think it must be... It must be story-related or something like that. Or my concern is that, like, there's a fish out there that I'm not catching because I think I've already caught it. That's why I'm kind of catching everything again, almost. I said it's only a zero to 50 meters fish, though. You know, it's, it's up at the top. It's not a deep fish. Of you, yeah, yeah, sure. Anytime I see a upgrade to the harpoon, I tend to take it. I don't think I really need the um, the bits, these things anymore, per se. Although maybe we'll find a better weapon at some point. You never know. Something else we want to upgrade. Maybe you want to upgrade the grenade launcher eventually. Maybe you need fragments of something else. Who knows, folks? Who knows? Mine. Buy a little seahorse. We want to grab as many different types of seahorses as we can get as well, because then we want to, um, you know, we want to take them into training for my seahorse army, racing team army, same thing, right? Oh, it's a new one as well. It was a big belly. Nice. Very cool. All right, so we're in the right depth for the one that I'm missing. If nothing else, rack up a few fish for the collection, you know. It's just there's something quite satisfying about grabbing several fish at once. It feels good. It's, it's, I'm going to chase that feeling in my real life. <laughs> I'm just going to dive into it and just pick up tons of fish. I don't even have to be alive. I'm just going to go to the, the fish market and manhandle all the fish. It's going to be great. Sounds deeply erotic. There was a seahorse. You scared it away, you numb. Where's it gone? Goddamn lionfish. 
I don't know if I'm crazy, but I feel like the number of aggressive fish has increased over time. Eggy, eggy, jellyfish. Eggy, eggy, jellyfish. Must catch everything. <laughs> it could be. Nah. See, whatever I'm missing, it isn't three stars I'm missing. I'm just missing it full stop. So it's like I'm missing something. I'm going to catch it. It's going to say new. But what is it? I, I, I genuinely don't have any. You know what it'll be? It'll be like one of those ones. Like the one that attacked me. It might be. It was that. Oh, it's a shrimp, that's why. It might be whatever's under there that I haven't figured out how to unlock yet. It could be that. What level are you? No, you're rubbish. I also can't find clownfish anywhere. Oh, oh I didn't know this tuna were here. I really want to catch some of the yellow tuna. heard me. <laughs> they weren't impressed. Oh, mystery fish, what are you? What are you? We may never know. <laughs> Screw that blue tank in particular. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Alright. That's where you go. I just don't know, folks. I don't know where it is. It's out there somewhere in the wilderness. Yeah, I thought that was new. Nice. I mean, um, whoops. If nothing else, we found um, two new seahorses in this little, little jaunt, which is pretty sweet. That is just such a small... You can't be harpooning a fish of that size. <laughs> Maybe, I mean, I can catch a tuna. I'm pretty sure I can catch a tuna. Without the thing. There you go. I knew that was new. Yellowfin tuna. We'll have to catch a free star one of these next time. They are usually around. The shock harpoon is kind of perfect for taking them on. Come on, let me at him, let me at him. Could the tuna be the fish I was no no it's not it's not it's not the right it's not the right body shape to be the fish I was missing. One more shot, baby. One more shot. Shoot ha It's not three stars, but it's three more tuna fish. I just I didn't wanna leave with my weight capacity being so horrifically low, you know, there's just it's all this room to play with. Gotta play with it. Oh god, my feet are freezing. I should have bought my slippers. I woke up at 8 a.m. today. It's terrible. It's slipping, folks. It's slipping. Right, Pacific. I'm gonna also I'm gonna take one of each. That's the idea. These are the lucky ones to get to race, the others get cooked. <laughs> <coughs> We've got some good stuff here though. Yellow and Tuna Road, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, am I though? I don't know what I'm looking for, really. Thumbs up. Um, shame he only sells us once. Uh, I've got a bunch of things to sell, I'm pretty sure. Uh, maybe I don't have a bunch of things to sell. I've got some things to sell. 
a bolt. Oh god, I've got 14 of them. I haven't been selling these things at all. Yeah, all right, 700 quid. Not bad. Uh, what's the other thing you sell? I don't remember. I don't know the flasks to do anything. I keep picking them up in the hopes that eventually they'll be useful. But generally speaking, unless I really need cash, I don't tend to sell things in video games. I think I'm good. What are we going to upgrade next? Um, God, level 6, that's max, level 7, level 8. Mm. Probably the hop. Mm, I don't know, actually. I'm tempted to maybe upgrade my staff a little bit further next, just to prepare for the future in that regard as well. Even if I'm just training my current staff, I might do that tonight. Is anything happening today? Today, no. Tomorrow. So tomorrow is Tuna Day. Uh, right. So next video, we're gonna go down to. We're gonna go to the Glacial Passage. Next video, basically. So very exciting stuff. And then open the restaurant. And then Tuna Day. So that's the next video. Cool. Thank you very much for joining me. I'll see you, lovely folks, very soon. Oh wait. Oh, oh. Talk to me, Rarinka. Two new seahorse. And by tip three shark up to three stars. We'll get the yellow fin up to three stars as well. It is only one species of tuna, it's the blue fin, so we must be getting like a different cut of the tuna. You know? As in one part makes one type of sushi and one part makes another type of sushi. And that's why there's two recipes. I'd like to I I, I am tempted to just pick those up. That's tiny. You're a big ras. Just haven't seen these. There's no way there's a marlin swimming around that I've somehow not noticed. It must be story related. It's this one that's annoying me. <laughs> it really is. This little dude here that's really bugging me. You are my Everest. Right. Thank you for joining me. Cheers much as always. Bye-bye.